بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Dear viewers, students, welcome to yet another lesson. We are continuing with the pronouns. And on our today's lesson, we are going to be learning about the interrogative pronouns. The interrogative pronouns. The interrogative pronouns, these are words or these are pronouns which are used to ask questions. When you want to ask a question, you want to know about something, these are some of the pronouns that are used to ask questions. Welcome. Interrogative pronouns. Interrogative pronouns. They are used to ask questions. They are used to ask questions. For example, what? What? What was your name again? What was your name again? Which? Which? Which is your favorite spot? Which is your favorite spot? Who? Who? Who lives here? Who lives here? Whose, whose, there is a new house being built. Whose is it? There is a new house being built. Whose is it? Interrogative, to interrogate means to ask, to ask question. When somebody is being interrogated, the person is being asked questions. So interrogatives, they are what that you are using when you are asking questions, when you want information about something, you use interrogative words. So today we are learning the interrogative pronouns. These interrogative pronouns are what we use when we are asking questions. So they are used to ask questions. They are used to ask questions. For example, we say, what, we use the word what when you want to know information about something. What was their name again? What was their name again? This means the person had told you his or her name before, but you have forgotten. You have forgotten the name, so you want the person to remind you their name once again or another time. What was their name again? What is this? What do you want? These kind of pronouns, they are called interrogatives. They are asking questions. Which? Which? Which is when you are making a choice. They are many things, but you want to choose one. Okay? They are many things available, but you want one choice. So which is used for choices? So for example, they are many sports. There is football, there is athletic, there is basketball, there is volleyball, there is baseball. They are different kind of games or different kind of sports. But which is your favorite sport? Which is your favorite sport? Among all the sports, among all the games, which one do you like the most? Which one is your favorite? Which is your favorite sport? Who, who, it is used when you're asking about a person. You want the information about a person, not a thing, a person. Who lives here? Who lives here? Meaning, the person who lives here. You want to know the person who lives in that place? Who lives here? Whose, whose, whose is used when you want to know the owner, when you want to know who something belongs to. So whose, the ownership or the possessor of something, the possession of something. Whose, there is a new house being built. You have seen a house, you have seen in your neighborhood, there is a house that is coming up. There is a house that is being built. And you don't know the person who is building that house, or you don't know the owner of that house, so you ask another person, there is a new house being built. Whose is it? Whose is it? Meaning, who is the owner of that house? Who is the owner of that house, or who is the possessor of that house? So interrogative pronouns, they are used to ask questions. For example, what, when you want to know information about something, 
what was your name again which when you want to make a choice or when you are choosing something which is your favorite spot who when you want to know about a person who lives here who's when you want to know the owner or the possessor of something there is a new house being built whose is it that is the interrogative pronouns for you the interrogative pronouns they are used to ask questions they give you more details or information about something or about a person and that is where we come to the end of the lesson thank you very much for watching please subscribe like comment share until next time wahada wabilahi tawfiq assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh